Hello Aries, this is your reading for the 6th through the 7th. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Let's see what we've got going on for Aries today. What's going on with my Aries today? Aries. Aries. Please show me what's going on with Aries. What's going on with Aries? Mm. You know, King of Pentacles. A lot of you are just focused on um, your job, work, your family. Just trying to be comfortable, I feel. Have a comfortable living. The Nine of Cups. Yeah. Be happy. Get your happy back. You know, focusing on, on you. Filling your own cup. Loving yourself. Doing the things that make you happy in this life. Hmm. Then we have the Queen of Pentacles and the Page of Wands here. Okay. So, we have the King and the Queen of Pentacles. There's somebody that feels like um, you are their wish. They want to be with you. You make them happy. Somebody that you've turned your back on, okay? Somebody that you've turned your back on. And then you have somebody else, I feel, that's interested. Somebody that's that's um, less mature, maybe, than you are. Maybe they're not sure if they are in your league or if they can even like get your attention. And I, and I get that you probably know who, who this person is, okay? And I think you're more apt to give this person a chance versus the King of Pentacles person. Is what I'm getting here. Mm -hmm. So I think you have really two people that are in your midst here. Let's see what this Page of Wands. Why is the Page of Wands here? What does the Page of Wands want? What does the Page of Wands want? The Page of Wands. What does the Page of Wands want? Huh. The Three of Swords. This person wants to discuss something with you. This is somebody that you know, for sure. And I feel like they want to offer something. They want to converse about something that, um, that hurt them or disappointed them. Hmm. Let's see what else we can get for the Page of Wands. Oh, the King of Chalices. I feel like this person is a little intimidated. Um, and that's why they're coming here as a Page of Wands. They, they're intimidated about discussing something with you. They are so very interested in you. But for some reason, they're heartbroken. Um, maybe they think they can't be with you. Let's see why the King of Pentacles is here. Why is the King of Pentacles here? Look at this. Ace of Cups. Somebody loves you. Somebody loves you. Mm -hmm. Somebody that I feel like um, acted like they wanted to be single before. Four of Wands. Somebody that wants a relationship with you. Somebody wants a relationship with you. This person may be married, does not have to be, because here you're coming as a Queen of Pentacles. You guys may have been in a long term relationship before or were married before. But now this person, I feel like, is wanting to come in and offer you something. They're looking right at you, but you're not paying them any attention, okay? But I feel like this is two different people here, okay? We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn here, and then we have, um, I feel like, Scorpio maybe here. Um, another Aries like yourself, Leo, Sagittarius energy, okay? Let's see why this is happening. Why is this happening? Yeah. You got somebody that wants to to work with you, wants to compromise with you. Probably after they after they didn't wants to get together with you. Okay. Wants to be with you. You make them happy with the lovers there. They're very attracted to you. And and now they want to to give you what they possibly did not give you before, because you guys are a couple here. I mean that's that's the bottom line. They're in love with you. This person is in love with you. 
for sure. Wow. This is strong, guys. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and again, this individual over here. And I feel like, I feel like both of these people love you. Whoever this is, I feel like both of them love you. And I feel like you're not talking here to at least one of them, if not both of them. However this person is feeling and whatever they want to discuss, I don't feel like, um, I, I kind of get the sense that you know that this person may have something else they want to say to you or something they want to say to you that they're not disclosing right now. But they haven't come forward. They haven't come forward. They're, they're, they're hiding it. Um, and, and they're thinking about it though. Most definitely thinking about it. Hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. We have um, Libra Gemini energy here. Huh. Somebody's not sure if they can have this with you. Somebody's not confident here. I don't think either one of them is confident. Mm -mm. I don't think either one of them is confident. Um, but I think this person more so is the one that's like, oh, uh, kind of shaky, you know. What what will she do or what will he do if I, you know, tell them what, you know, how I'm feeling? Will they hurt me? Will they reject me? You know, that type of thing. I feel like this person over here is way more confident with these pentacles. Way more confident that if they suggest to you that they're now willing to work with you, then, you know, you'll be all in for it. Hmm. So the outcome is here. Seven of Wands. And the Seven of Cups. Hmm. You know, here I'm getting that you guys feel like you have options you don't have to accept any kind of nonsense from from this person this person or anyone else for that matter okay mm -mm. you're blocking out any kind of confusion any illusion and you're standing your ground for what you believe and what you want and what you feel like is going to bring you success here so at the end of the day I feel like you know you have your pick honestly Okay, now I do see this person, the Page of Wands, moving in before the King of Pentacles. And then we have the King of Swords under the bottom of the deck. This is something that feels a little cocky, I feel. This individual over here is a little cocky. This person, not so much. This person probably is more humble. Um, you intimidate them a little bit more. I don't think you really intimidate the other person. But still in all, you don't give a shit who you intimidate because the bottom line is um, whatever it is that you feel like you want or you don't want, um, you're blocking that shit out regardless of how the uh, whoever feels. Okay, so we have Leo, um, Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Pisces, Cancer, um, Capricorn energy here, Taurus, Virgo maybe. And um, I, I think I already said any other fire sign, Aries, like yourself, Leo, Sagittarius, okay? So that's what I have for you guys, and I'll be speaking with you soon.